also contain vitamin E that treat uh, pigment pigmented skin and <music> Welcome to Map Shine Shine Web. So today I'm reviewing this cream called White Secret, or some of you call it um, Secret White, but that's White Secret um, Lightening Body Lotion. So the reason why I'm here is very interesting. So please, if you're first time watching me, don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment, and leave your bell for notification. So this white secret uh, is a lotion that, according to what it does, let me read a bit. White secret contain ingredient proven to enlighten your skin and remove head uh, blackheads and spot. Also contain vitamin E that treat uh, pigment pigmented skin and touches. That's what it written. Prevent reappearance of dark uh, touches adopted to all skin type apply twice a day morning and evening after the first app applies the effect will become visible your skin will be more luminous your dye more on uh, unify okay so let us not go on and on and on and on if i'm going to and this um product is uh made by Pabri, uh, Fabrique, it's a French Parodis. I don't know where this one is, but I don't know. Parodis, it could be like Togo. Yeah, something like that. So, the reason why I'm here today is that naturally, I'm somebody who is not into skin lightening. So, I had uh, the story behind why I'm doing this lotion eh, is that I had a uh, pigment around my neck. It's going down a little uh dark pigmentation around my neck and a bit on my forehead when i gave birth two years ago uh 2018 november i gave birth and 2019 november i gave birth so uh after uh during that birth of those two babies i developed a condition called osteostic choreosis some of you might not heard it myself i've never heard of that condition until i became pregnant when i was diagnosed with that uh condition in Europe, I live in the UK. So, what the condition does is it gives you itchy skin. Your skin will be itching you. You and I'm somebody who have um, I have a G a G says PD. It's a condition that is similar to this kind of asthma and all those things. So, it gives me shortness of breath. I can't uh, breath. I can't use uh, lotion that contain too much perfume and other stuff. So I need to be careful what I do. But during that uh, uh, pregnancy, I was given some education. I was told not to put any body lotion on myself because of the condition it will trigger it. So I never use any cream. All I do is just take my shower, nothing, for two good years. So imagine you not using cream. What will happen to your skin? Your skin is going to be dead, uneven. And so after those pregnancy, I noticed that I developed pigmentation around my neck and my forehead, which I didn't like. If you are in my position, you know there's one portion of your body that maybe is not lighting up or something. You don't want to, you know, keep that one. So, I then talked to a friend who said, oh, I knew a lady who did in cosmetic, uh, cosmetics products. So, let me take you there. She'll give you a very nice cream that will clear the tear. I said, okay, my sister, I don't want to tone my skin. Oh, no, so it's not toning. So, then, when I went, that is when she gave me this uh, white secret it comes with um this is the white uh, unifying compression uh complexion serum yeah the serum and this is uh you see white secret cream unifier i think it's for the uh, the knuckles and the knee where you have a uh, dark area and this is the face cream so i bought the whole thing the whole product and i came home unknown to me when i came home I opened this lotion, my dear, hmm. and I pour some into a container. Oh, my whole house was in a mess. What am I talking about? The place was smelling. I was like, what is this lotion this woman has given to me? Or what is this one? Very, the smell is so strong that you can't pinpoint exactly what it smells like. Because I know I've, I've, I have, it doesn't smell like hydroquine. 
because uh, hydroquinone uh, creams when you smell you know how the smell is yeah but this smell is very unique unique not in a positive way but bad it, you don't know exactly what the smell is like but I don't know, it's something I could so strong. Whenever my um when my, my children came into the all right, mommy, what is burning? I said nothing is burning, this is a lotion. I just opened so I then called the lady because I had a phone number, I gave her a call and I said, Look, dear, I can't use this body lotion. Though. It's very strong, I don't like the smell. And he said, Look, you want to clear your pigmentation, so I'll advise you not to dispose it. Please try and use it. Please try and use it. So I said, Okay. But she advised me to add uh, any lotion that have uh, a bit of a perfume in it. And I'm someone I can't use a lotion with perfume. And I need this pigmentation to go. Now some of you are watching my think, Yeah, it's going. It's going because I'm using a different product. I'll talk about that one later. So I had this uh, Garnier Intensive Moisturizing Lotion. Which is, uh, who has a very mild smell, you know. So I then pour a little. Add it to this lotion. And then I started using it. I still didn't like the smell. But then... You know, I have a, something I need to clean. After one week of using this lotion, then I noticed, instead of this cream, clearing the dark pigment, my neck was going so dark, my arm, you see, <laughs> I'm showing you my, you see, then, I saw this dark knuckle tin coming on my arm. If you look at this two arm, you see this one is a bit lighter. Because usually I use this one to apply the lotion, my left hand, you know. This one was going dark. The knuckles was becoming dark. I started developing stretch marks around my armpit area. And I was like, what is going on though? So, I used this one. Since they said this one clear dark knuckles. I used it. I didn't mix it with the serum. Because the cream say it's very strong. It will give you two to three shades within five days. So, and you know I've mixed it with uh, Garnier. So, I don't want to add any serum to it. And then, I started using this one too. To think that it's going to correct uh, correct the knuckles, eh? This thing even became worse. The whole my whole knuckle was going dark. I like what? I don't like lotions where I will use and then I'll be walking in the street. Then my skin will be looking taking colors and all that. I don't like it. Like you have Coca Cola body, fountain hand, and a pineapple juice uh, fingers. I don't like it. So I've stopped using this product. So what my advice for you, I don't know. That is my experience. And then, I, I'm somebody, like I said, I'm not into bleaching lotion or toning lotion. So I then came to YouTube to find out what this cream does. It is then I came across some videos and the people were revealed. I was like, hey, well, oh, and I understand. So please, if you're looking forward to use this lotion, I don't know. It's up to you. You can go and use it if you want to have dark knuckles, dark knee, the uh, stretch marks within the shortest period of time. It's up to you. But for me, mm -mm, I'm done with this lotion. Oh. I'm better off either using this or go for a lotion that is my. I'm not going to use it. So it's up to you if you want to use it. And I always say, before you use any cream on your skin, please and please and please read about it. Mine my uh how do i call it i was uh let me say a newbie or oh, uh i couldn't research about this lotion when i had it if that is after i saw what i didn't like then i started reading about this lotion you see what i mean so please whatever you put on your skin please be very careful you know these lotions they are there we all want a good body who doesn't want a good skin we all want to look good and bright look nice you know when you are doing your selfie the first crack that you take you look nice you don't want a situation whereby you are shooting a, a picture you shoot and then somewhere it's looking different you know what i mean yeah i understand we all want to look good but please let's be careful what we put on our skin that is my experience with this lotion and i'm not going to use it as i'm talking to you i've ordered for a new lotion i'll do a review these ones are going to go on the bin you see my knuckles i don't like it this is not how it used to be so Please, please, please avoid the cream. Somebody say it will work for them. Fine, if it work for you, please, the longer use of it too is going to mess you up. That's what I'm telling. So it's your choice. It's your choice if you want to use this lotion. But for me, my personal experience, mm -mm, like, like I'm not going back. Backward, <laughs> someone will say, forward ever, backwards never. I'm not going back to this cream. No, I'm running for my life and for my skin. So thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe and help my channel grow thank you so much i love you god bless you bye bye